Hello, I got this question, which says, Hey Alejandro, thanks for your excellent tips. A question, is there a keyboard command that allows us to open and close all folders in one click? And how did you close by clicking on the TCP icon? So yes, and this is something I use all of the time and it's just the best thing in the world. Let's say that you have a session like this and it's kind of large, well, just decently sized. A good way to just hide every all, all of the folders at once is this keyboard command that I got that I can just run like this and make all of my folders collapse in this way. It makes the session look so clean and this way I can navigate my session way better this way because I can just go ahead and open any of the folders later and or just open all of them at once and if I want to see all of the envelopes I will go like this uh, with this other command that I got uh, it's a it's also a way to show and hide all of the envelopes in the session or if I want to see just the envelopes of one track I can show them up like this and yes, it's a way to make things so clean. And I can collapse, toggle the collapse state of each of the folders by pressing these commands. Now, what are these commands? It's these ones right here. So for collapsing like this, I'm opening, I'm actually not clicking here. I'm actually running a, a shortcut. I select the track and I hit this shortcut, which is called cycle folder collapse state i have this map to tap i feel like it's a really good place uh, for a shortcut for this shortcut because i can just run that and it's gonna cycle my folder collapse state and what do i do if i want to do that for all of the folders i got this custom action and it's mapped to alt tap and it goes like this this these three things in here one is select all folders this is an sws action and there's this order script by mpl which says toggle between normal and super collapse what the script does is basically it's going to skip the small collapse state you know there are usually three states which is this one this one and this one and again you can adjust this in preferences track control panels there's three states. I currently have this one set to hidden. That's why you see my tracks and don't get tiny like this. Otherwise, it will, it will look like that. Some people prefer that, and that's okay. But I like them have. I like to have them hidden. So this script basically just toggles between those two states, eliminating the small state. So I can just open and close in just two states. And lastly, I have track on select, which just clears the selection. So I can just run this custom action and it's gonna open all of my folders and it's gonna close all of my folders when I hit it again. That's a very, very good custom action to have. Um, and then for the envelopes, I have this map to shift tab. And this one is just this action. Toggle show all envelopes for all tracks. You can map this, I have the map to shift tab. So it's gonna show me all of the tracks envelopes like this. And I have one for just the track selected. So if I want to see just the track selected envelopes, I can just run that, which is also very, very useful. And I love that they're toggles, so I can just hit the same shortcut again. And this makes everything just so easy to navigate around my folders. I really like the small state, that's why I still use it. I don't just set my toggle collapse folders to two states. I like the small state and I like to select like um, several tracks and put them all in small like this and maybe one big. But yeah, hope that was useful. Feel free to ask me any questions so I can make more videos like this.